Ginger Welsh Allotments. I am Bethan and I've been really waiting to do this update all week but it's been so windy I haven't been able to film outside so I've rushed outside now while it's not so windy and uh, true to form cue the wind but I wanted to show you our chickens because we've got four new chickens. We've given the chickens a bit more room as we've put the picket fence around the existing coop and we started off by putting our old coop which is this one here uh, in the ground with the picket fence here and put the four new birds into this this chicken coop and left the other five birds in the old chicken coop because at first you need to give them a bit of time to settle in so it's best if they can just sort of look at each other through the uh, mesh so this is one of our new ones the speckled sort of necks they've all got speckled necks and that's our old one that's the old rescue ex caged chickens these chickens have come from a farm from up the road they're about 20 months old and the farm are renewing their stock so they were just getting rid of about 200 chickens for no other reason than that they weren't laying them to its maximum potential we got the new chickens about nine days ago now we had them a week last friday and it's sunday today and as i said we kept them separated until Friday where we let the doors open to the old coop and we just let them sort of mingle with one another and then we put them back into their own coops in the night and last night I put them in the big coop so I'll show you where they all slept last night I've showed you this in other videos but I just wanted to show you where they were all sleeping last night so they were all fitted in here and there was loads of room for more chickens not that i'm saying we're going to get any more chickens but um, they were quite happy there hasn't been any fighting which i was pleased about and they all seem to have integrated well i um we're going to take out the small chicken coop today because what they're doing I'll come out here so you can see what they're doing is jumping onto this one then onto there and then flying off into the garden so I seem to be spending me and my husband seem to be spending a lot of time chasing the pigeons round the garden but it, it is it is all funny and what was even funnier this morning was the chickens were actually chasing our cats around the garden not the other way around so at least we know the cats are um, friendly with the chickens. Well, not friendly, but they're not going to attack them. Yeah, so this is one of the new speckled ones. Their names are Ginny, Lily, Hermione and Minerva. Now, can anyone tell me what the theme of that is? There's no prize, I'm afraid. It's just to see if you can guess what the theme is. There are still a few things we need to do with this um, picket fence. One is to paint it so that it matches the coop so it all looks quite seamless. Two, put in the chicken wire because as you can see the chickens are getting out through that bottom bit which also needs replacing down by that gate there. And See, oh, and then I'm going to put some flower pots around here so that um, it all looks pretty and integrated with the garden. And we either need to clip the chicken's wings or put in a slightly higher bar across the top to stop them from flying out. Because I have seen one chicken jump from the ground onto the fence and then over that way as well. So they are terrible little escape artists, let me tell you. But they are so cute i could just watch them all day 
but I won't because I've got some seed sowing to do. That's the latest from what's going on with our chickens. Uh, we're very happy to have nine chickens now. Two of them don't lay at all. They've just come to us for retirement. Um, but the other seven are producing really well and um, our neighbours are very happy because they are getting lots of eggs off us at the moment. I'm thinking I might be putting a stall up selling free range eggs soon. Anyway, thank you for watching and all I can say about this is excellent job. Okay. We've now moved the uh, we've now moved the old chicken coop, and the chickens are being fed mealworms, which, as you can see, they really, really enjoy as a treat. They go mad for it. So it looks like they got quite a lot of room now. We've moved that coop out of the way. I would say maybe it's a room for three or four more rescue caged hens, possibly.